was like a beautiful dream. There I stood on a balcony overlooking the town square of Zlin, the hometown I'd left almost 50 years ago in anticipation of the Nazi invasion. On this drizzly December afternoon in 1989, every inch of the square was packed with thousands of people, seemingly oblivious to the cold, out to welcome me and my wife. There were flags everywhere, along with pictures of my father, the late founder of the Bata Shu organization. Right on, right on, they responded as I told them how much the world admired their heroic fight for democracy. I managed to say a few more words. Long live Bata, they chanted. Give us back our chief. In my 75 years, I've been greeted by many people, ranging from factory workers to heads of state. But there had never been anything to compare with this particular welcome. It was an experience I shall never forget, all the more so since I know that, in the eyes of those people, I wasn't so much a person as a symbol.